Auction overlap could be one of the reason that your Facebook ads are not performing. What exactly is auction overlap? Let's understand in this video. This is also called audience overlap problem. Now in a typical campaign structure, let's say inside a campaign, you have two different ad set, ad set one and ad set two. In both of these ad set, either you are targeting the same audience, same interest or very similar interest because of which what happens there is an audience overlap there is there are some common people which you are targeting in both of these ad set since both of these ad set has a different ads okay ad one and ad two now when they try to enter into an auction you know both of these ads from a same facebook or instagram page this scenario is called the auction overlap now the myth in the industry is that when this happens both of these ads will compete with each other and since they are competing with each other in the auction uh, for the same inventory the cost will increase but that is not the case this is a myth facebook actually prevents this from happening let's say there is such a scenario where you know you're targeting the same audience in both of these ad set or this could be you know not just one campaign there is another campaign Whereas you have another ad set which are targeting the same audience in both of you know those campaign. In such a scenario, what happens? The ad which has the highest total value will only get to participate into the auction. The other ad will not get to participate into the auction. This is what Facebook says. Facebook actually prevents this from happening because of which what happens? they will not self compete they will not compete with each other the cost will not go up because of that reason cost might go up because only one ad is getting a chance to participate in the auction to win the auction and other ads is not getting a chance now this ad it might so happen that you know uh, there is no delivery for this ad the ads are not this ad is not delivering because you are targeting uh, you know same audience because of that reason another thing can happen is because of that your cost will go up you know because you're not getting any uh, acquisition uh, because this is you know not entering into auction most of the time uh, you don't get any acquisition so your cost also goes up or you know since it is not participating into auction what happens the ad set may never come out of learning phase so these can be the problem eventually because of which your campaign CPA will increase uh, uh, or might increase. This is not the scenario for you know, most of the case. So in such cases, what you should do is you should try to avoid to target the same audience. 100% uh, you know, overlap avoidance is not possible, obviously, because you know, there will be some uh, similar interest which you will have to target and reach out to so there will be some overlap um, you know happening in the account so you can't avoid you know some overlaps but you know when you see that there is a overlap where you're targeting the same exact audience in two different ad set try to avoid it now let me tell you how you can automatically also avoid it so facebook gives you this feature where you can automatically get the notification when you have an audience overlap or you can you know actually you know uh, pause the ad set facebook can pause the ad set for you where there is a audience overlap or auction overlap now how do you do that so if you go into facebook ad uh, you know facebook ad manager inside that you will create a rule a automated rule click on rules on top create a rule and then you will see this option called reduce auction overlap when you click on it and click on next it will give you two three options here three options if you see turn off overlapping ad set and increase the budget so you know if you go with this option it will uh, turn off the overlapping ad set and increase the uh, budget into other ad set there is second option turn off overlapping ad set so it is without increasing it will only turn off the overlapping ad set and the next one is send notification only so if you just want notification and manually pause the ad set you can do that as well so i personally like this one whenever there is an audience overlap i just need a notification and then i will try and pause the ad set i don't really want 
Facebook to pause the ad set for me or Facebook to increase the budget for me. So you can actually go with this particular, uh, you know, uh, notification or any of these, which whichever suits better for you. So after that, click on create and done. Now your rule is created. If you go to rules and click on manage rules, you will see that there is a rule created and it is active for all ad set. And this rule will run once in a day uh, to check in your account if there is any ad set or any two ad set or you know multiple ad set which are which has an overlapping audience or common audience and it will notify you once you get a notification you can take your action if you want to pause the ad set you know increase the budget into other ad set whatever you want to do after that to avoid the overlap you can do that if you don't want this rule to run you can pause the rule as well from here directly so this is what auction overlap is this is what audience overlap is i hope this video was helpful let me know in the comment section if you have any questions uh, i would love to answer them do like the video subscribe to the channel and i will meet you in the next video very soon thank you